Hi everyone, this is Anthony Giuliano with the Linked Institute blog, and today we're going to take a look at how to change your profile headline and summary. When you think of your profile, the most important parts of it that probably come to mind are number one, the photo. That's the thing people will see anytime they see you on LinkedIn. Number two, your name. That's obvious. Then after that, the headline, because it follows you around LinkedIn just about as often as your photo. And the next thing is the summary. The fact of the matter is we live in a soundbite society. When people go to your profile, they may not read much. They may not read much more than your summary. But if you get that right, you've done the majority of the work you need to do to get your profile off to a great start. So so how do you ensure that your headline and summary say what you want them to say? Well, that's what we're going to talk about. Now, the first step is to log into LinkedIn, then go Profile, Edit Profile. Now, the example I'm going to show you involves the new profile design, but this applies even if you're using the old profile design. The details are just a little bit different, but the thinking is the same. Under my name, you'll see that it says marketing and social media strategist, speaker, teacher and trainer, and writer. There's a little pencil icon to the left of that. If I click, you're going to see that I have the opportunity to change what's in that box and click save. Now, one note, I chose the headline that I have because I think it accurately represents my work better than my job title does. So you definitely want to know what your headline is. You want to make sure that it captures who you are as a professional, and if not, change it. Now, what about the summary? Same rule applies there. You want to make sure that it represents who you are as a professional. You find that by scrolling down under background. You see summary and the trusty pencil icon. You click on that. You have their opportunity to make changes here in this box. Scroll down and click Save, and your work on the summary is done. Again, those are two of the most important parts of your profile, so you want to make sure they're accurate and they represent the story you want to tell as a professional. Very easy to change, like most things in LinkedIn, and now you know how. If you have any questions about that or anything else related to LinkedIn, please let me know, either in a comment to this video or in a comment on my blog, which you can find at linkedinstitute.wordpress.com. Thanks.